I haven't done this in a while, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to a match day vlog. I'm here with Donald. Um, yeah, first home game of the season for me, purely because I had other commitments, work got busy, could have made the first home game, and the rest of the away games uh, been busy as well. It's a bit, it's been a busy year this time, but yeah, we're back, heading down to the boats over here, as always. Get a little beer in. I'm gonna have a beer today, Charlie. Yeah. I'm gonna have a beer. No, I'm gonna have a beer. Too. I'm gonna have a beer. I haven't had a beer in months, so I'm gonna have a beer. Chill out pre-game. Let's get the three points. Come on, West Ham. We're back. Go on, do a little iron. Go on. What are you doing? Oh no. Oh my God. What are you eating, mate? I'm letting loose. Yeah. <laughs> I'm letting loose. I'm having a Kit Kat and a beer. Go on, let's see the Kit Kat. Eat that. Eat that Kit Kat. You ready? Yeah. I don't know how many calories this is. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Go on, Mikhail. Oh, you savage. Oh, not like this. You savage? Not like this. Not like this. Not like this. <laughs> Ten minute review with your favourite two. <laughs> you like that? How are you feeling? Oh, How are you feeling? I think we, we look good on the attack. Yeah. Vulnerable on the defence. Yeah, well, Fabianski's just made a beautiful save from Very a cutback. But, um, I mean, we've had our chances, they've had their chances. They've had three shots now, I think. I've just counted. You're counting? No, I'm counting. I'm a stat man now. Oh, man. Well, stat man. Uh, thin man and the stat man. That's thin man. <laughs> but yeah, 10 minute review. It's, we both look good on the attack. That's it. Mm. I look good on the attack. I think we look a little bit more vulnerable in defence than they do. That's yeah. The Hopefully we can bag ourselves the first goal. We need Clearance. to capitalise on our chances. Yeah. Otherwise it will cost us. Definitely. Are you on the side? Can't pass. That's it. I've blocked it. I can't pass. I can't pass. Why not? Go on, drive. Why? There you go. There you go. Opportunities. 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 Oh! My camera work is shit. Come on, you big bastards. That was in there. What? No one in the box. Free kick on the edge of the box, 33 minutes in. Who takes the view? Felipe Anderson. Not first one. No. Sorry. I just, no. Um, Anderson's not even standing over, is he? I know he is. He is. He's got the right foot. What do you reckon? Him or not? No, uh, no, right. This player is We don't squat free kicks. Alright then. This. It doesn't matter because it's a Diop scoring from the corner. Yeah. With his third leg. The bigger picture 
it's a Diop scores from the corner. Did you just miss what I said? I know, his third leg <laughs> means he's got a big penis. Yeah, not good. Maybe not. Well then. Go on! Oh. Now we score. Oh. The training ground routine. <gasps> I mean, it would have been a training ground routine if anyone could do anything with it. I want 11 on out of it. Just a bit. Come on then, good movement. In. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Do you mind? Excuse me, Missy. Bradley, you're interrupting me. Got this bloke doing a reaction test, mate. Oh, well, here we go. Oh, go on, teacher. I remember the times where we had the hammerettes. How far we Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, if you can, get behind Bradley as he looks. Yeah! Go, Bradley! <laughs> every single game. Go on, Bradley! Come on! Oh, is he finished? I think he's finished. Oh. Oh, the hammerhead. Oh, wow. This is. This is. This is. You can't tell him. You can't tell him. That's cheating. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh, that is it. Oh. Half time, lad. Yeah. What are you thinking? Nil nil. I mean, we predicted a 1 1 draw. Yeah. But it's a nil nil draw so far. The half time entertainment's uh, decreased in value since. Uh, what do you mean? Bradley did excellent. He got 27. What do you reckon for the second half? Okay, I think we, I, I think we lack some kind of attacking presence up top where obviously we, we know as like a fan and anyone who's a third party. Arnie has that, but I don't think there's the extra quality or hold up and the our pass is terrible, mate. Bro, no, I said it earlier, I've got to say, we can't pass a ball. We cannot pass a ball. Wolves are knocking about one, two touch passes. And we what they're doing though, they're spreading play really well. So, right. Because they're playing, uh, it's either 3-5-2 or 3 They're four, getting three. down the wing well. They're using their width really well, whereas we look very narrow in defence. Yeah. And we need to be able to match that and we're just getting exploited on the wings. But you never guess what? We've got flags. So... Who's what the real wingers? What do you have? Yeah, exactly. What you got, Wolves? United, you've got, We've got you've flags. Got Jose, We've got, got flags all the way around the pitch, right? <laughs> so that means we're winning this game. What's your names, lads? Harry. Thomas. Harry and Thomas, yeah? yeah Thomas. Well done, you're in the vlog. Come on, you irons. <laughs> Focus me, lads. Jesus, there we go. Start the second half. Uh, you never guess what's happened. It's not fast enough. Yami, Yami, Yamalenko. Yami and Arnie. Yami and Arnie up top. Hopefully that changes the dynamic of the attack. Hey, hey! Better football. Better football. Better football. Oh, oh wait. Oh, it's fine. It's yeah! Oh. Come on. It's a big goal right there. Big goal. Oh. Oh. A big goal to miss. <laughs> Damn it! Oh yeah. Oh yeah! Who was that? Was that Fredericks? Yarmolenko. Oh. Brazilian touch. That's the favela touch, right? Come on. Oh! Oh, my God. oh Jackie Wilshire! Oh oh! It's it! Oh. What are you doing? Kuna! Positive! Positive! Come on! Come on! Oh, Screen shake! Second half, 10 minute review with your favourite team. Jeez. I like that though. Yeah. Alright, uh, we're 10 minutes into the second half. A lot more positive than the first half as well. So, there's pretty bubbles we're in the air. You've seen the screen shakes. We've had some corners. It's looking great. It's looking great, mate. All we need is a goal. Come on, West Ham United. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, poo. Oh, poo. Oh, poo. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, you dippo. Oh, yes! Well done. Well done. I thought we was going 1-0 down then. Yeah. What is it? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> I don't think I was recording it in time, but they should be 1-0 up. They should be 1-0 up. Oh, my God. <laughs> So, 10 minutes left, pretty much. Arnie 
Team 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 Link up, beautiful. Very close, coming, coming true, becoming 1-0. They're keeping dead, dead on the field. But do you, do you think we're going to nick the game, yes or no? A minute ago, I would have said no. Yeah. <laughs> but then suddenly, Chicha gets the ball, passes it to Arnie, and then he's just done bits. I think he scores. Who knows? Who, kno who knows? I can't give a definite. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah, he's good. He's good, he is. He's good. We well, he was going to go for him as well. No. I do want to say, Arnautovic was one of the only players to clap the fans after. And Diop. And Diop. So Diop and Arnautovic, the only ones that came over and clapped the fans, which I, I appreciate because the rest just walked off down the tunnel, which I understand you're pissed off, but so are we. Um, and then, yeah, the team can't pass. There's no composure. If you notice, when, if you watch your match a day or whatever, Wolves, it's a maximum of like three touches that the ball's got. But they, they're good at knocking it around. They use the whip well. What are we doing? They had a, they had a direct game plan. That's the thing. We, we sat too deep at times. We didn't spread the play. Fredericks was awful today. Yarmolenko, um, when he came on, was good. He carried the ball. That's the thing. was good. The, ten minutes of the, the first 10 minutes of the game were good. The first 20 minutes of the second half were good. And then the capitulation. The thing is, when you play football, you make mistakes. And when you make mistakes, they often lead to costing your team. But a mistake for me classifies when you don't capitalise on your chances as well. We had three or four chances where we should have scored and we didn't score. That's a mistake and that cost us as well. Yeah, you're wondering why I'm yawning, it's because I just sat through 90 minutes of a nil-nil and then they scored in the last minute. I'm very angry. So we have Everton away. Chelsea at home, Man United at home, Brighton away, Tottenham at home. What? I don't see us picking up three points. Where do you see three points? I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't think we're beating Everton away. I think we're going to lose to Chelsea at home. I think we're going to lose to Man United at home. The only three points I see is Brighton away. Right. That's it. And that's away. And they did us last season. We're getting dicked left right to It's capitulation for West Ham again. I bet you're really happy that the match day vlogs are back, aren't you? I bet you're really happy. So you can all laugh. Even like for our sadness. Yeah, like for sad times. <laughs> Alright guys, so boom, that's the end of the video. I just finished editing it, but I did want to explain to you guys why I stopped the vlogs last season and why um, I couldn't do the first games of this season. So, last season, as you all know, wasn't a great season for West Ham and it wasn't a great place in and around the stadium and it wasn't a nice atmosphere to be involved in and especially whilst trying to make a fun video for you guys to enjoy. I know a lot of you guys will see it as... Um, like missing out the bad times, but it really wasn't anything like that. It's just because when I'm not enjoying it, I didn't even enjoy going to games at that point last season, let alone making a video on it for you guys. And um, it just wasn't the kind of content that I wanted to be bringing to my channel, really, if I'm honest. And it's not like me just glory hunting because it's not going great this season anyway. But there's a bit more of a positive vibe around the club because we've made a few signings and we've got a new manager. Although, We've lost all four of our opening games and we've conceded 10 goals. So, we'll see how this season pans out. The reason why I couldn't get to the first home game of the season is pretty much Sidemen Sunday shoots get organised throughout the week and then sometimes they'll be sprung on last minute and um, it just so happened that there was one on the last Sunday uh, or Saturday, whenever it was, that we played Bournemouth. So, I couldn't make it and the away games, um, sometimes I don't enough, have enough points to get tickets to the away games anyway. So, I'm, I'm, I've only had my season ticket two years. But yeah, that's all from today. If you do like the return on the match day vlogs, make sure to crush the like button. That'd be absolutely awesome. Uh, and yeah, stay tuned because hopefully this was just getting back into the swing of the match day vlogs because I haven't done one in a while. I haven't even filmed myself in a long time. So I'm getting back into the rhythm, okay? Um, if you're wondering why I'm like ducking down, it's because my camera's sat on my desk and um, I'm quickly doing this for you guys. But yeah, leave a like, subscribe if you're new around here. And yeah, 
side mates day today, it's Monday. We're about to go and win the league. Let us know if you want side mate kits. Side mate kits, side mates kits. In a bit, later. <laughs>